Three attorneys now on this case, one of them traveling from Pennsylvania to meet with his client only to learn he had been abruptly moved. Kodak Black's mother also learning today her son is no longer in South Florida. I want to make sure my son okay. I want to make sure they don't kill my son. The mother of Kodak Black in tears, fearing the fate of her son as he serves his time in federal prison. My son needs everything to me. The concern comes after a series of social media posts painting a picture of civil rights violations behind bars. The rapper claiming he was beaten, refused medical attention, starved, and more. In one post writing, they are strategically killing me slowly in here. I have been humiliated over and over again. We know something happened in that prison. His mother reaching out to high-profile attorney Benjamin Crump. She wants to make sure that while he's in their custody, that he doesn't end up dead. Crump and co-counsel say they were scheduled to meet with the performer Wednesday morning at a prison facility in southwest Miami-Dade. Literally, only hours before we meet with them, they put him on a bus to Kentucky. We believe they intentionally moved him so he couldn't meet with his attorneys. I ain't losing my brain. The rapper, whose real name is Bill Capri, is currently serving nearly four years after pleading guilty to weapons charges stemming from his arrest in May just before he was scheduled to appear at the Rolling Loud Music Festival. Last week, his Instagram posts alleging abuse in prison got national attention. These allegations are to be taken seriously. And his attorneys say that's exactly what they're doing. So we're here trying to get to the truth of what happened to Kodak Black and his mother is demanding the truth. If my son die, I'm gonna kill myself too. Please, please, I need help. The attorneys are now headed to Kentucky and they say they are planning legal action. We have requested a response from the Federal Bureau of Prisons. We're live in Miami. Jessica.